Eight and a half, nine years later to see where we are, not only getting ready to fly the first commercial crew vehicle to the space station, but uh, with crew on it, but uh, also the, the follow-on Artemis program and all the excitement that that's bringing to, you know, potentially go back to the moon in a few short years. It's just, it's, you would have never thought, you know, after we landed Atlantis back in 2011 that, you know, nine years later we would be where we are in, in some ways and it's, it's, it's uh, better than I would have imagined in so many. It's, it's really interesting to try to, to think about the, the role that we'll play in history as we go forward, but I think for both Doug and I, and I think we've, we've said this uh, a lot of times, is that we're going to focus on the, our role in history kind of after we've uh, successfully accomplished the mission. I think uh, there are just so many technical factors and, and things that we need to focus on to make sure that we pull this off, that uh, our place in, in history or, you know, even trying to put our names in the same sentences as, uh, as the folks who uh, have come before us is, uh, uh, it, it seems premature until, until we've, uh, until we've uh, pulled it off.